In the midst of all this acclaim, Edith faced her biggest challenge of her career, Audrey Hepburn. Now, this is an actual test. This was made in England, flown to me here in Hollywood. It was my first acquaintance with Audrey Hepburn, and as you'll see, it's pretty successful. When they first met, Head was convinced theirs would be one of the great pairings of Hollywood, the crowning achievement of her career. She threw herself enthusiastically into screen testing costumes for Roman Holiday. But from the outset, the relationship would be a battle of wills. When Edith first laid eyes on Audrey, she wanted to change her. She wanted to pad out her thin figure. She wanted to hide her skinny legs. But Audrey Hepburn had a very determined attitude about how she should look. She liked the fact that she looked different. And she convinced Edith that it would work. Once more, Edith would take the strategic route and brilliantly adapt to the whims of her star. The costumes that Edith created for Roman Holiday were classic head and demonstrated her unquestionable talent for adapting and surviving. But Hepburn's next film, Sabrina, would be a major disappointment for Head. When the director, Billy Wilder, suggested that Hepburn wear something from Paris, it was a major slap in the face for Edith. In Paris, Hepburn met Givenchy and fell in love with his designs. Sabrina. His Highness. Can you keep a secret? Secret? Givenchy designed both the little black dress and the satin gown that stole the film. Head may have been down, but she wasn't out. She never complained about Givenchy's involvement, but when she won the Academy Award for Sabrina, she never shared the credit either. Well, I think she had a lot of gall for one thing, and another thing is she had a contract with the studio. Everything that was done at that studio, she got credit. And they couldn't, couldn't dispute it. I don't care if the clothes were made in Paris. From the day she got her start in Hollywood, Edith had never had any scruples about taking the credit, even if it was sometimes for other people's work. If that's what it took to succeed, she was more than willing. But success was going to be harder to come by now.